We have a customer piano in for cleaning and repair. Go ahead and take that uh, music desk off, Andy. Pianos get just decades of dust and dirt that's um, in the action and under the strings on the soundboard that just can't be removed at the home. So this piano is a Weber, um, which is made by Young Chang. It's uh, just a model name of a Young Chang piano. And you need to pay attention to the serial number range because there's a problem with Young Chang pianos made between a certain serial number range that we'll show here on the video. And um, it manifests itself in that the action um, gets to misbehave. Andy, go ahead and uh, play this a little bit and see how the action feels to you. the problem play that last part again Andy. so I'll play that and hold that note and you see the hammer is blocking the string and uh, play that again Andy it kind of double strikes play piano so you can kind of make that show how that hammer is just kind of bobbling up there in that position now a technician might uh, regulate that out by increasing the let off of that hammer um, however, on these pianos, that's not actually the problem. In the end, I'm just going to pick it up here. The problem with the Young Chang action of the serial number range is that these action brackets were made of a bad alloy. And the result of that is that these brackets actually have expanded. This is an action bracket removed from a bad piano. And here we see an action bracket that also is bad in this piano. I'm going to show you the problem. You'll, you may notice um, some bulging in the material in the middle part of the webbing here. Um, it's actually, it, it has cracks that you may be able to see in the video. More obviously, if I hold a ruler up to the bottom, you can see that it's warped. The, the bottom feet are not flat as they're supposed to be. It's actually bowed. And that raises the rails attached to the brackets and causes everything in the action to be out of whack, out of its motion limits. You'll see cracks where it's expanded and at the screw holes where it's broken. This bracket was just entirely uh, broken in the piano. So these have to be replaced with, with correct parts. It's a uh, job that takes uh, several hours of time. Until that's done, the piano will never play correctly. In the case of the brackets that I showed you that have expanded so much, it will jam the action in the piano such that the technician cannot even remove the action from the piano to work on it. It's a becomes a real problem.